At a recent concert, hip hop artist, Grammy winner, and Bernie Sanders advocate Cardi B had a drink thrown on her while performing. She retaliated by hurling her microphone at the culprit, a sad theme that keeps getting worse and worse. Performers are starting to fight back against those who believe they can abuse these performers. They go and see. There were several angles posted of the debacle. Another from the concert would show the woman apologizing for doing what she did immediately after seeing and hearing a microphone whiz past her head. It occurred in Las Vegas, Nevada. Cardi would retweet a note that called the beverage-throwing attendee a jealous-ass B-word, which is the name of another one of her songs that she is promoting. As we mentioned, sadly, the trend continues. In recent months, B.B. Rexa needed stitches after getting hit in the face by a phone. Kelsey Ballerini paused the concert after getting struck in the eye. And Pink was emotionally traumatized by a fan who threw their mother's ashes on stage. At one of her recent shows, Adele called out concert goers engaged in such bad behavior. Have you noticed how people are like forgetting blanking show etiquette at the moment? People just throwing blank on stage. Have you seen them? I blanking dare you. Earlier this month, Harry Styles crouched to the ground as he was walked off stage after a fan pelted him in the eye with a flying object during his Love on Tour show in Vienna. Styles 29 quickly placed his hand over his face, paused as he crouched to the ground, and then continued walking up a flight of steps after being hit. A sad question Euro News Culture asked was, are audiences getting more aggressive? Eric Stewart of Global Crowd Management told the outlet, there is a definite change in people's behavior. There's a lot less tolerance, a lot less patience, a lot more aggression. The phrase that is used most frequently is a sense of entitlement. Crowd management experts have noticed an increase in aggressive behavior at live events, including concerts and sports matches. Since the coronavirus pandemic, lockdowns were lifted, Stewart said. When we speak with our colleagues around the world in Australia, New Zealand, America, Canada, Ireland, Everybody's saying the same thing, he said. We've always had incidents of people throwing things on stage. It's never been a major problem, but now people are throwing hard things like mobile phones. I've not heard of it to this level before. It's a really difficult thing because artists want to be seen and loved by their fans. But if an artist does pick up a phone off the floor, take a selfie, and then pass it back out to the person that's thrown it, then they're encouraging that behavior which would then be copied by others and may actually increase the danger. Just to sign off here, one thing that really bugs me about all this is seeing many right-wing influencers, some who are even with Turning Point USA, take this opportunity to say Cardi deserved it because of the way that she has crafted her career, because of the lyrics that she puts out. Some of those same people, when it comes to criticizing a wordsmith have also found to be guilty of plagiarizing other people's work and that person may or may not be named Benny Johnson.